Hi viewers. Today in this example we will see how to automate web apps using APM. So I have selected a test case. So steps are first I will navigate I will open a www.seleniumhq.org then it will navigate to menus project then it will navigate to about menu then it will navigate to support menu then it will navigate to documentation menu and then it will navigate to download menu okay so let's see how we can automate this so these are the capabilities which we need to provide it so here i have selected the chrome so there are two options in the earlier builds if we provide only browser name comma chrome it will automatically open a chrome, chrome browser and do the test or else there is a one more option where we can provide a chrome browser app package name as well as a app activity name okay <coughs> Currently, I am using a Selenium 1.3.4.1. Okay, so let's see how we need to execute it. So, my APM server, let me start restart my APM server. Just hold on for a second, it will take. Okay so my server has been started and this is my emulator okay okay let me start the script okay see here script has been started forwarding the port starting chrome driver on 9515 so here now you can see here we we'll get an error message a new session could not be created right and did not get session redirected from chrome driver Okay, this is the error which usually most of us are facing, right? Okay, so wait a second. Okay, so install a Chrome browser first in your emulator using a command like this adb install chrome and wherever the your chrome.apk file is present you just need to say adb install and the apk file name that's it so it will automatically install your chrome browser so my chrome browser is already installed now i will execute my script again See here script has been started wait for some time and let's see okay it is trying to start a chrome driver on port number 9515 see chrome driver has been started
see here now it has been redirecting to www.seleniumhq.org so now it is redirected to selenium.org now it is going to project menu okay now if you see here it is going to some other let me try to expand it it's not possible right now but okay so you can see here that is that it is navigating it one by one here now it is doc going to documentation my internet connection is slow so that is the reason it is uh, redirecting little bit slow So here we have uh, navigated to one, two, three, four, five, five menus, right? See here, test has been executed successfully without any failure, right? So this is the way we can do a we can do a web app testing. Thanks for watching video and do subscribe to my channel. Thank you.